what's popping you guys it's the girl ashy dramatics to kick off the ending of my birthday celebration i was gifted serrano's bakery now anyone who knows me knows that i love serrano's bakery it has different styles of cheesecake from lemon oreo nutella red velvet salt to caramel and baklava for those who don't know baklava is a traditional pastry in greece it is very sweet but also flaky in texture and it has nuts in it there's also other pastries like fruit tarts mousse donuts cookies pies different styles of bread ice cream and also greek souvenirs the reason why i love serrano's bakery is because the texture of the cheesecake is nice and light it's flavorful but not overly sweet so to be honest you guys it's really worth it you guys have to check it out i just wanted to let you guys know that serrano's is the best cheesecake in the city okay you guys you guys can't at me i i'm sorry it's better than cheesecake yes i said it better than cheesecake factory cake is better than any other store bought it's better than grocery stores serrano's is the best place to get your cheesecakes desserts your ice cream your everything i'm i'm sorry <laughs> there's nothing i can do about it but like you know just letting you guys know the prices went up because Toronto is getting mad expensive nowadays, which is okay. You know, to get like slices of cheesecake used to be four dollars literally two weeks ago, and now it's six dollars for each slice, which is mod. Okay, but Serrano's is the way to go. Just understand that. Huh? So Greeks, y'all are doing something. Love my Greek family out here. <laughs> All right, time to go. For dinner, I was treated at All You Can Eat Robo, which is a traditional Asian cuisine that has many different styles of food for your enjoyment. These are the Robos that serve you, bring you to your table, bring you your meals. Um, so I find it cute how it can show you how big it is, how they look like when you enter into the building, and then it brings you to your seat. Now there's still servers here who are asking you how many guests you have and all that jazz, but the rest is up to the robos to do their job. I was given a tablet to place my order. It is very easy to operate. On the left side, it shows you the categories of what your interests are. And all you have to do is click on it and then it has the images of items as well as the description and how many pieces you'll get. Now, because it's all you can eat, you can get as many as you would like. Thank you. Thank you. Oh, well, that's what you do. Bye. I will. Every time you place your order, your, your meal will come by one of these robos. Um, it happens every time you order something. So the more you order, the more you get to have fun <laughs> with these robots. What I like about it is that they are sensitive to touch and movement. So if another robo is in the way, the second one would be patient enough to wait for it to pass. And then it will come and serve you or pass by you if it needs to go to its other destination. Tell me, tell me your secret, your 
your fantasies, yeah, yeah. I will give you everything you need. This will be a great spot to bring your children because it's also an interactive experience with the robos. Um, the price of the food is pretty decent. I really don't know what it is, so when I find out, I will show you guys below um, because it does not say anything on the website, sadly, but that's okay. I also don't know what these desserts are. <laughs> I am so sorry from my experience of eating at Japanese restaurants they're usually mousse or tiramisu some sort of mango I'm surprised they don't have ice cream either to be honest but yes one of my favorite things to have are the deep fried bananas because you know your girl loves bananas and it's come with some chocolate sauce so we are all good but again, this will be a great spot for someone's birthday and I really enjoy myself. I don't think I'm going to come back um, because of the robos, to be honest, because after a while you kind of get bored of them, <laughs> sadly to say, but I'm definitely coming back for the food. It was really good. No, it's fine. So yes, I... I Thank you guys for enjoying my birthday with me or thank you for everyone that has. <laughs> thank you for everyone who has wished me happy birthdays. I have really enjoyed myself. Um, as you guys know, I went to Sephora. Ooh, this is a terrible spot to pause your video. But yeah, your girl still got a gift from Sephora. So uh, shout out to Sephora. You know what it is. <laughs> Not Sephora, not, right? Safari Niagara here in Fort Erie in, um, well, I can't say Toronto. It's not a Toronto, Ontario. It's near, exactly near Niagara Falls. So I had an amazing time. I got to see animals, which you guys know I enjoyed. For the, yes, giraffes. I got to feed a giraffe. I had birds all over me. I had I had goats smiling at me today. <laughs> it was a good day. Animals enjoying my company and me enjoying their company. Um, it was a lot of things happening. Even though we we came at a really good time, it's like there's still so much to do. Um, so make sure you guys go and check out this place if you really want to have some fun. Um, it's super amazing and yes. Thank you guys for all of the happy birthday celebrations. I really appreciate it. And you know, it makes you feel like, well, it makes you realize that you have people who actually care about you. So yes, I can't wait to show this on my vlog. And we'll stay tuned for more drama ink. Peace. <laughs> have the video of how we look close up but I'm not gonna do that because I don't need to see it <laughs> so <laughs> let's continue on Ashley okay. how, how do you feel? I feel great okay come on and I'll make them oh my you god we gotta save this, this, this uh, child this is a lot of what you asked for no, but we we're still not done yet. We should have added the. Now you gotta take everything. Up. Ashley, how do you feel? Oh, I feel great. I feel, uh, I feel yeah. okay now, but before yeah. I was irritated. Why were you irritated? Oh, Jesus. A lot of stuff. Okay, okay. This okay. has to go here. Hey, what? I should have done this because you're mm, this whole design want. situation. Oh, yeah. 
To be honest, you guys, I really don't know how I feel. Like, I'm happy that I got to enjoy my birthday. Um, but at the same time, all I really want is for my dreams to come true. There's so much things under the scope that is happening. And I just want everything to get better for myself. Going. This side, the cakes are also we, we not. Should have not lit it. Before. It's a beautiful disaster. It's a beautiful day. So, for some of you guys who are wondering, me and my best friend Haywan, we are Virgos. <laughs> so we are literally going to take our time and accomplish everything we set out to do. We plan on putting all of those candles or whatever fits on that cake. Honestly, that cake was last minute when we purchased it. So everything kind of just combusts all at once. But we really took our time to just place everything together. I was determined to put 27 candles on that cake because I was going to make 27 wishes. Yep, you got that right. 27 wishes. I was watching this movie um, where this woman who did exactly the same thing every year, she would... Um, light a candle and make a wish and write it down. So I was like, okay, that's a good, you know, idea because I need my wishes to come true. I need God to to do something, you know, work His magic on top of me, actually doing what I can to let my dreams come true. I don't know. Something has to happen. So I'm just hoping that. Everything that I've been manifesting comes true, and I really enjoy myself putting the pieces together. One more. I'm gonna hold this one in my hand. Okay, just because this one has seven now. 20, like at least seven. Seventeen, seventeen. I was just sick with seventeen. Okay. Am I supposed to, I, I can't say it out loud. My, my, my birthday wish. Yeah, I'll say it out loud, huh? No, keep it to yourself. Just say it to yourself. Okay. Yeah, keep it inside. Pray on it. May you get it, Jesus' name.